Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode uh, on my channel about my game. By the way, um, I'm sorry for being that inactive um, over the last month, but my mic just stopped working. And now I'm back and uh, with good messages. Um, as you probably have, no have noticed by now, um, we are in Visual Studio and that's because all these files are ending with, with CPP. We are working, uh, or I, uh, I am working, on the engine in C++ because it's faster and I can use Vulkan. Um, here's, by the way, tons of Vulkan code and I can show you what it does. Um, it's not much, but it's basically, I think most of you will be coding, uh, just the setup stuff. So, I call it Asleep, that's German for it's alive. Oh, well, well, one moment. My, I closed this accidentally. Um, and yes, um, you can see it uh, prints out tons of information. This is a little uh, validation stuff I wrote, uh, thing I wrote. Uh, validation layer was loaded, swap chain was loaded. Um, it prints out that I have um, a GeForce GTX 1050Ti built into my machine. This is the Vulkan version. The driver version is a little ugly because every driver in, um, does that differently. differently. Um, vendor ID is the same. Uh, discrete GPU may, means it's plugged uh, into my main board via PCIe. Um, and geometry shader, uh, I could print out a list of hundreds of lines, but for every um, uh, there is not just a unified command for printing out this information. I just have to get the information from an object and then just print it out. And this takes forever. And here you can see some layers from NVIDIA um, and some extensions. And down here, that's kind of irrelevant. Um, I have this object here. Um, and yeah, if I stop it, you see it closes correctly, and because I selected it, it will stop now. So, um, yeah, that's basically it. Um, to show you here are the diagnoses. I didn't figure out how to um, yeah, change um, Visual Studio to uh, English, so it's still in German. Uh, here we have the diagnoses. It uses 51 uh, megabytes of... Um, storage, uh, um, memory, and I think that's actually not that bad. Um, so, I hope you liked this little update and I have a request for you. If any one of you is good at doing, um, yeah, I would say 3D modeling and texturing, please uh, say it in the comments because I can't do that and I need your help for this. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching and have a nice day.